I'm against the school system because it's actually teaching people to be poor. So I remember raising my hand when I was nine years old, talking to my, ninth, my fourth grade teacher, and I said, you know, when am I going to learn about money? And she says, we don't teach money at school. The love of money is the root of all evil. My father was the head of education, PhD, all that stuff. I go home and ask him, so why don't we learn about money in school? And he looked at me and said, because the government doesn't let us teach that subject. The government tells us what we can teach and what we can't teach. And I thought that was strange. And I said, but aren't we going to school to learn about money? He says, no, your job is to get a job. I said, but you get a job to earn money. He goes, no, you're supposed to just get a job. I went, no, 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 no. Isn't the purpose of a job to earn money? He goes, you're correct. Because the school system will never teach you about money. The school system was designed to teach you to be an employee, which is important, or a doctor or a lawyer, a specialist, but never about money. God wants everybody to be prosperous. But our school system is keeping us poor. But the average person is so blinded because they went to school and they were taught by poor people. And as Lipton says, it's handed down for generations. And the average person, the reason they're poor is they haven't failed. You know, they play it so safe. They haven't made any mistakes like they taught in school. That means they don't learn anything. That's why the school system is actually fundamentally corrupt. It's anti-education. <laughs> don't make mistakes and don't ask for help. And I think what most people do is they let their parents or their friends talk them out of life. So afraid of failing. But failing is how we succeed. You look at the you guys look at guys like Edison and all that. They failed like 10,000, no, 1,014 times before he invented the light bulb. You know, our schools punish you for making mistakes. That's why we have so many people who are so afraid of admitting they make mistakes or afraid of failing. Poverty is passed on. It's taught in your families. And middle class is taught in families. And, um, <clears throat> you know, Einstein said, you know, imagination is more important than knowledge, but knowledge empowers imagination. And what most people lack is real business knowledge, like accounting, you know, like debt, like taxes. You gotta know that stuff, but they don't teach it in school to anybody. And so the people right now who are sitting at home <clears throat> who are struggling financially or worried about money or unhappy, they may be making a lot of money, but unhappy with what they're doing, it was probably taught to you. You know, your super ego was taught, get a job, work hard, or, or you'll never be rich, or the rich are evil, or whatever. The banks, the schools, the education system, they keep people poor. They teach people to be poor.